This afternoon, an LAPD officer is suing the department. She alleges the department didn't do anything when another officer shared intimate photos of her. We have assignment editor Mike Rogers at the desk investigating this one. Mike. Yeah, Tom and Jazz, this one's weird because the officer that allegedly spread those nude photos of her was her husband at the time. Now, she says she went through his phone and discovered that he was sharing these photos with other members of the LAPD. She immediately reported this to her supervisors, and a criminal complaint was actually issued, and her husband ultimately arrested in all of this, but here's where the lawsuit comes in. The officer says the department didn't do anything to stop the spread of those photos or even remove the officers that were helping spread them from her division. I have a copy of this lawsuit right here on my computer where she talks about exactly what happened. It says the department retaliated against the plaintiff by failing to do all that was necessary to protect her from additional harm. In this instance, the department did not transfer the two officers out of the division or place them on loan pending the outcome of their internal affairs investigation. The decision not to move the officers was further retaliation for plaintiffs protected activity. Moreover, the department did nothing to ensure any of the officers who it knew had obtained these photographs and videos to cease and desist their actions in soliciting or disseminating the photos and videos of the plaintiff which they had obtained. Now this lawsuit was just filed by this plaintiff who was a police officer with a 14 year career at the LAPD. Uh, many awards according to her attorney. I did reach out to the LAPD for a comment on this. They say that they do not comment on pending litigation.